High Folks Total Sales Solutions in Jackson, Mississippi, where we sell diesel trucks and we sell lots of them, folks. Today we're going to list one of the most difficult trucks to find on the secondary market. And you talk about a beautiful truck, a super nice truck that's going to be a super value. We're going to show you a wonderful truck. It's a 2015 GMC, 2015 GMC 2500 HD Duramax with SLT package, four wheel drive, got every option, folks. Sitting on a perfect set of expensive tires, the spares underneath it. When I say this truck's got every option, I mean it's got everything. Navigation, moonroof, heated and cooled seats, you name it, somebody got it on this truck. It's got a great stance, the paint works great. I'm not going to say it's pick proof because someone's going to go, ah, oh, what about that little deal? Or my mother's cousin told me to look here, but I'm t for us, it's pick proof. Come on, we'll show it to you. Beautiful truck. If you was going to order a truck, if you had all the money that you could spend and some more you wanted to get rid of, this is the way you would order a truck. The bumpers aren't rock picked. The headlights aren't foggy. They got the LEDs I don't in them. Know, I don't know what a new one like this costs, but I imagine in the $70,000 range. But you can see here, Dan was telling me this little front piece here, for example, that little chrome piece is $450. These trucks are some kind of nice. It's a local southern truck trade in here. You can see those of you who live in the Midwest and everything, I always worried about rust. You don't have to worry about this truck. Like I say, it's been a resident here all of its life, but look how nice and pretty this truck is. The leather is outstanding. The seats are just how we got them. Um, Expensive they haven't been inserted. Oh, leather steering wheel is perfect. Mats. It's got memory seats, it's got um, heated and cooled seats, Bose stereo, moonroof, OnStar, uh, inverter, front and rear parking sensors, etc. Well, you can look here up at the door jams. Look how beautiful that is. Look over here. So, as I often say, some kid didn't show this. I mean, you can't clean one like that. That's We can't. Someone Someone was proud of this truck. They drove it. They took care of it. Of course, as I say, it's power, power most out of every option. And the truck is just, just beautiful. Paintwork is grand. Well, I better unlock it, I guess. I can figure that. Doesn't unlock it. No, that's the mirrors. I'm hitting the wrong button. That'll unlock it. Chrome's beautiful, but look back there. See, it's got the... Uh power outlets, the seat flips up, it's got the big heavy duty, I guess they're WeatherTech mats, carpet underneath is good, headliner's perfect, rear defrost, cab corner's perfect, southern truck, paintwork none whatsoever, you can see right here no paintwork, tell that. Look here, the bed's perfect, the lines along the truck, see this line? Nothing's ever been slammed around it. This original bed liner in it. The bed has not been cut for a gooseneck or a fifth wheel. Spare tire. No, no rock pecks, look at this. No rock pecks, it's not been on gravel roads and in mud holes. Spare's beautiful. Well, it's got this rock guard material on the bottom to protect it. See, so it's got the step pockets in the I have rear bumper. Finished about tailgates working properly. You can see that mat just put in there. Bed, beautiful under it. Spread bed liner. Spare, heavy duty inch, SLT packing. Look down the side. No rock pegs, no tape. The only step up from this truck was the Denali, which is a different grill and a little wood grain on the interior. This one's got every option. Well, Same as a Denali. See these exhaust pipes and everything? You can tell it's never been in mud water. For about 10 grand less or more. See all the little seat pockets. Huh. Let me get that money out. Uh, leather's perfect in all the seats. The dash, the leather on the dash is perfect. The headliner does not have a spot on it, period. I know people always worry about them. The 
the uh, carpet is beautiful. Uh, you can open it if you'll move on. Okay. You'll get out of the way. I'll make you think to get out of the way. So you got the manuals, you got the uh, Line X warranty deal. It has, uh, let's see, where is it? G373 limited slip, Z82, Z85, Z88. That's heavy duty suspension, trailer towing options, limited slip, OnStar, like we said. Got everything. Not even thing to fault this truck. Uh, Imagine set of good years. Got the said. LEDs in the mirror. See the good year tires once again. This is just little stuff, folks, that we point out when we occasionally get a truck like this. But you see this? This is kind of a almost a felt inner yeah. fender, and this it's in good shape. But if people are riding down muddy roads and rocky roads, it doesn't look like that. And this truck has just been on the highway. A Duramax, gosh, and this is new. Dan will drive it with you in a little while and you'll really appreciate it. But if you've been shopping for a late model Chevrolet Duramax and you thought, I never could afford one, well, you can afford this one, folks. I promise you, it's going to be a value and it's going to be a truck that whoever buys is going to be tickled to death with. And I promise you this, if you ship it, as most people do now because it's become so uh, inexpensive to ship. Dan's got an end of where he gets that done. When it gets there, when it gets to your house, you'll be just as pleased with it as the day you touch the button to buy it. But it's a wonderful truck. You won't find one nicer. Don't believe your wife or your cousin or your uncle or your aunt or whoever says, well, my nephew's sister's brother had a nicer one. <coughs> they didn't. It's a 2015 GMC it's an SLT 2500 HD Duramax diesel. Got it all, folks. Everything you can put on a truck was put on this one when it came from the factory. Wonderful truck. Thanks for watching our video. We do appreciate it. Look forward to visiting with you about this 2015 GMC. Look forward to seeing you here in Jackson, Mississippi. Thank you. Hi, folks. Dan Dale here. You've been listening to my dad talk about this truck. Now I'm going to take you on a test drive, but before I do, just want to show you some stuff under the hood. First of all, we don't clean under hoods. This is just how this truck came into us. You can see a little dusty here and there, but no signs of walling and mud holes or anything, because when they've done that, all that bare aluminum stuff like on the firewall will get this brown patina that you just cannot clean off, and this one doesn't have that. Uh, you can see it's got the right antifreeze in it. It's obviously been taken care of, but the main thing I want to show you is you can see no smoke, although smoke's not a big deal as long as it's not puffing. The main thing is, set the cap down, it doesn't blow off. No blow-by. Blow-by is engine compression getting past the piston rings and into the crankcase. Not necessarily the sign of a bad engine, but it's a sign of wear that this truck doesn't have. What it does have, uh, interstate, yeah, matching pair of interstate batteries. I'm gonna shut the hood, take you for a spin. You can see, not rock pecked up. I mean, there's one or two here or there, but nothing serious. One thing we forgot to show you, I don't know if this is factory or somebody added these little steps, but they're handy and they just kick up out of the way when you're uh, when you're done. So that's a pretty cool thing to have. Let me show you a few things under the hood. Of course, you got your moonroof. That works. You got your sunglasses holder. Um, you got your sliding tilt. Got garage door opener. OnStar. Heated and cooled seats. You can cool the whole seat or heat just the back or both or leave it on AC. <coughs> See the LEDs light up in the mirrors. Um, memory seats, automatic headlights, fog lights, four wheel drive. Now Ford calls this tow command. I don't know what Chevy or GMC calls it, but it's a built-in uh, trailer brake controller. So that's always handy. It's got power pedals, traction control, cab light, parking sensors, lane departure alert, 
exhaust brake. You can see up here it's got collision alert. If you run up on somebody ahead of you, it'll start, it'll flash something on the windshield, it'll vibrate your seat, do all kind of stuff. Of course, it's got Bluetooth. There's all kind of things you can do on the dash. You can uh, see what stereo's on. You can uh, access your phone, navigation, uh, all kind of stuff like that. But we will leave it on info. On the screen here, of course, you got navigation, all different settings for that. It's got Pandora. It's got weather. If you subscribe to the uh, series, you can also get weather. Um, OnStar. It's got, you can get tons of presets on here. That's the nice thing about these. You got tons of presets and you've got steering wheel controls behind the steering wheel. If you want to change the stereo uh, or do whatever with the one side on the other side you can turn it up and down we'll leave it on nav as soon as I put the backup camera on you can see the lines match the steering wheel so as I turn the steering wheel back to the right it will uh, show me kind of basically where I'm going so that is a uh, handy handy feature like that said the dash and all that is in good shape uh, I guess I need to turn I hate when people call you and you don't answer so instead of just waiting for you to call them back they, they blow your phone up that gets on my last nerve but anyway uh, now you'll have to excuse my shaky camera work I'm filming with one hand and driving with the other on some of the worst roads in the city of Jackson but even though the video may come out a little shaky rest assured this truck has a great ride and drive one thing you can take away from all these potholes and stuff I'm hitting is that it's tight there's no not squeaking or rattling or thunking I've been driving this truck a while now I've probably put I think two or three thousand miles on it it's got a hundred ninety four thousand but man it don't look it it don't drive like it I mean these seats are perfect the bumpers not rock picked up uh, the hoods not the engine's super quiet it's not deleted although it can be deleted but <clears throat> I wouldn't worry about it unless something acted up and then delete it but um, no warning lights lit on the dash or anything like that goes down the road just like it should it doesn't pull to the left or right it doesn't vibrate or pull when you hit the brakes um, if you want to fly in drive this truck home you can we'll be glad to pick you up at Jackson Air National Airport during the regular business hours we'll uh, bring you back to our office do all let you let you test drive it we'll do all the paperwork and feedback and everything and, and let you get on the road um, we do it all the time best part about this be the trip home have a fly in or drive, take the train or whatever make a little trip out of it going home uh, do some sightseeing I want you to look at this um, it does have auto climate uh, both front seats are got, have are heated and cooled got two separate zones for the climate now these little switches here you got USB you got two 12 volt outlets and you got a 110 outlet so you got the inverter and everything on it you got the uh, manual shift mode the the tow mode I'm gonna try and hurry because my camera battery is telling me I'm, I'm running low uh, now if you're from the Northeast or the Midwest we know people from there buy most of our vehicles because they're looking for good deals on rust-free trucks and but we understand not everybody has two or three days to spend driving or flying in and driving home so if that's you don't let the idea of having to ship the truck scare you off from it and especially if you look up prices online don't let the prices scare you off because depending on how much of a hurry you're in we can save you as much as half off uh, basically 
Uh, most of these guys you find online aren't shippers. They're just brokers. And they'll charge you thousands of, I mean not thousands, hundreds of dollars up front and they call it a deposit. But all it really is is their broker's fee for arranging transportation. So they all use this one website not open to the public called Central Dispatch. And we're on Central Dispatch now. We spend all the money to be on it so we can offer our customers wholesale rates on shipping. So if you're interested, shoot me a text, 601-376-9869 with your zip code. I'll get you a good ballpark figure on shipping. Um, it won't be an exact figure. It'll be ballpark. It'll be close within 50 or 100 bucks or so. Um, and if you're anywhere near Dallas or Houston or Atlanta or pretty much anywhere in the state of uh, Florida, we can get you a real good deal on shipping. So um, beyond that, like I said, just shoot me a, a text with your zip code and I can fill you in on that. If you have any questions about the truck, call me. Uh, I'll be glad to answer them. You see, we're going, well, I ain't going to say how fast we're going. We're going faster than we should be. But it goes down the road perfect. The steering wheel, the leather's perfect. It's not ate up. Uh, the ventilated, the cool seat cooling works. I got it on. I don't know of anything on this truck that doesn't work just like it should. Uh, bed's not been cut for a gooseneck or a fifth wheel hitch. Uh, that's a GM mat just somebody put in there to protect the bed. Uh, it's not hiding a hole in the bed or anything. Um, windshield, I don't see, there's no cracks. I don't even see any rock picks in it, uh, for that matter. The, uh, the leather in it is in great shape, no rips or tears. There's just no smoker's odors. Now, that means a smoker's truck, uh, no pet odors. This truck, uh, it's a local trade-in. And so, it, my understanding is it's been in Jackson this entire life, or this area, I would think. But um, it does have Bluetooth. It's got the hands-free. It's got Pandora. Um, it's got the the good Duramax diesel. I think the horsepower is like 440. I don't know. I'll have it in the eBay description, the horsepower. But it's got a lot. When you put your foot in it, this truck will get up and go. Oh, there is one little rock pick right at the bottom I don't know if you can even see it but it's just a little peck it it doesn't look like a star or anything that'll run uh, and I'm we try and nitpick our vehicles I, I don't mean to make it sound worse than it is but we don't want anybody leaving us bad feedback over a, a rock peck or you know a bulb being out or something simple like that so if we know about it we try and you know point it out so there's no misunderstanding no hard feelings or anything uh, now we've been driving 10 minutes. You can see on the dash, no warning lights lit, no service lights, any of that. I like to show the dash after I've been driving a while because you know it's easy to hook your scan tool up, kill a light, and take a picture and say, oh look, no lights. But if there's a problem and you haven't fixed it, then as soon as you go to driving, that light's gonna come right back on. So that's why I like to show the light dash after we've been driving a while so you can see for yourself that there's no lights lit. But uh, I think that about covers it. If you have any questions, like I said, give me a call. Want to make an offer, give me a call. Want to know what it takes to buy it, any of that. Just call me, 601-376-9869. Appreciate you watching the video. Look forward to seeing you here in Jackson, Mississippi. Thank you.